Hi, thanks for tuning in. In this video we're going to be playing Clone Tycoon 2, so hopefully you'll like it um, and give the game a try yourself. If you like what you see in the video, please give us a thumbs up. Obviously, you feel free to subscribe. And if you've got any games that you'd recommend uh, we check out on this channel, um, please put them in the comments below. Thank you. Uh, we're going to get rid of my ugly mug now and we'll get on with the game. Cheers. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start a new game. We're just going to choose a random plot. Now, the purpose of this game, at least to begin with, is to build up um, an army of clones and to make as much cast as possible to build your base. So you can see over here we've got someone who's already got a pretty decent base. Um, if we come and have a look over here, all these dudes running around, they're all um, different players' clones. There's also some NPC clones as well. And once you kill them, uh, whether it's an NPC or another player, you uh, get cash and which you can use to upgrade your base. Uh, we'll also be able to unlock some miners uh, shortly as well who go ahead and get some stuff from these rocks. So we'll go ahead and dive in. So as you can see at the moment, we start get our first clone machine and we can also arm ourselves with a sword. So over here now, very shortly, we should see some of our clones come out. Gold bars on his shoulders aren't uh, very good, but they'll go off and they will just uh, start to fight other clones. And if you make sure we equip, equip the sword as well. Ooh, we have to turn fight mode on. That way, any of our clones uh, that come out now will have swords of their own. And hopefully, start getting us some cash. We'll go out and we'll help uh, just to kill some of the clones for now. See if we can make some money. You can see up here, we've only got 25 at the moment. And what's pretty cool about this game is, well to begin with, I thought um, it was a bit pointless, uh, if I'm honest. Um, didn't really seem to be doing anything, but then I found um, just through some clues in the game there are a little, few little bits of hidden things. Uh, it seems to imply that if you uh, manage to take over this world that you can get to a whole new other world as well which um, sounds pretty cool haven't been able to get that far yet in my main game but um, we'll see if we can get that far in this one so we'll just uh, try and make a bit more money still maybe we'll farm these NPCs did we get that one? yeah we got that one Oh, he got me, got me, got me, got me. Oh well, here's another clone coming. Right, we'll see if we've uh, got enough to build anything there. So 175. Well, we can do another clone machine. So we'll do that and we'll increase our clone durability, make them a bit stronger. So hopefully, yeah, we should see how we've got two clone machines now. So we should stand a little bit more chance of making some money. How much did we need? I think we needed 100 to get to so we'll the next thing. Yeah, we should be able to buy something else now. You can also see here that um, you can build up gems as well. Now, they're not gems that you buy. Uh, later on, we'll be able to um, mine gems as well. Right, so this is our little mine that we've set up here to begin with. So, shortly, uh, we should see some more clones coming out of here. And they're, and they're gonna start mining these rocks. And uh, over time, we'll have some more build up. You can see on the left hand side here, and we'll be able to sell it. Okay, so we've just unlocked a better sword there, and um, so my guys should do a bit better when they're out fighting. 
So we'll just build a little bit of our base here so you can see how that starts. So everyone's base looks the same, which is a bit of a shame. But nonetheless, the finished base is still quite good looking. It reminds me of sort of a Bond villain lair, if I'm honest. Once it starts to get going, you can have missiles on top and you can get a like a flying car, I'm going to call it. Uh, and later on, you can unlock a spaceship as well, which is quite cool. So we'll just show you this mine around the back. Hopefully we've got some resources now. Yeah, we've got some resources. So here's my dudes. So if we just hit sell, it will sell these resources we've got and give us some extra cash as well. Um, as you unlock more and more things, you guys can mine um, more stuff uh, so that you can unlock these. I think they were diamonds and gold, if I remember rightly, and then gems as well near the end. There's things you can unlock. There's pets you can unlock. There's invisibility cloaks. You can change what your clones look like, change what you look like. Loads of different things. Loads of different ways to customize it. So I'm just going to carry on playing now for a bit and uh, just build up the base. Okay, so after a bit of digging around, I think I found out how we um, can complete planet one so I think we need this fly tool so sadly I'm gonna buy some gems which I didn't really want to do but we'll get it done so we can get this video done let's buy the fly tool cool let's make sure my clones are all doing what they should be doing and we need to look a bit better as well. Let's go as a skeleton. Make sure we're armed when we go to... I'm assuming if we're defeating something we've got to fight. Cool, so now we can fly. So let's see if this takes us anywhere. Oh, what's that? That looks like I don't know what that is sort of spaceship, never seen one of those before. And we seem to be moving away which is cool. But are we getting any closer? Oh, oh we are moving, look, there's the lava. I'm guessing that's the lava one that's moving. Let's see if we can go a lava world then. It does seem to be getting closer. That's all we need to do. Okay, so this is the lava layer, three skull keys. Do have any weapons? No weapons, okay. Oh, it's literally lava. The floor is literally lava. Oh, so it's like an obby inside, that's cool. But it looks like we've no checkpoints, which could be, uh, could be tricky. I'm guessing, oh no. Oh, that's harsh, you gotta start again. And 
new game up there, teamwork game. I actually do nothing unless you have to do them in a certain order. No, one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to save this for a uh, different video while I explore this. So uh, thanks for watching. Hope you've liked it. Um, hope you like the game uh, Clan Tycoon 2 because it's pretty good. Uh, I think just to make this video, I've been playing it for two hours. Um, so really enjoyed playing it. Um, if you like what you've seen, subscribe, give us a thumbs up, all that good stuff. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much. Okay, so you can see we've um, built up our base a little bit. Um, we're actually rejoining during a meteor shower. Uh, things like this happen occasionally uh, to take everybody out. As you can see now we've got a little room going on around here. I've got a computer going on. I can't remember what that thing is. This gives you an idea of how far we've come in terms of unlocking stuff. And um, we're just saving up for another clone machine. Which is actually going to release babies into the battlefield. We've got enough to get this um, next clone machine. So let's get that done. Baby club machine. And as you can see, because we've built walls and things, loads more bits and pieces have unlocked along here. So other things that you can um, do later on, well now when we've saved up enough, is you can have different types of clones. So we can have ones with special attacks that are either air-based, fire-based, electric-based, poison or mystic, which I think is a bit magic-y, makes them a bit stronger. And this is where I discovered the um, clue as to um, to how to do a bit more. So if you notice this basement is locked, if we click on it, we get this follow the telescopes message. So uh, we're gonna have a look at the telescopes if we can get across without getting beat up. So when we go in here, I found there's these two different layers we can go to. So um, we need to defeat the lava layer to unlock the basement. I have no idea what's in the basement. I hope it's something cool. Um, defeat Planet One, which I presume is where we are now, uh, to unlock the helicopter. Oh no, it looks like we're on the Tycoon one, so we need to somehow get off this planet and go to either of these uh, once we've done that. And I don't think there's anything up here. I'm guessing that's the other planet, um, as and when we can get to it. Right, let's go back to our base, because we should be able to build something now. It's pretty cool, every time we die you do come, just come back to your base, which is nice. I think I'm going to upgrade my guys um, who are mining, so they can unlock a bit more, help me make more money. So it seems the aim, or certainly the way I've approached it to begin with, is just to make as much cash as possible, as fast as possible. You sell your ore as often as you can, upgrade the mine, um, the pickaxes, so you guys who are mining can make more money, and unlock all these research computers. Um, purely because it helps you bring in more money. So, giant terminal, can't quite afford that yet. And there's a little baby coming out. They just um, help cause a little bit of extra damage as well. I don't know if they have little baby weapons. Oh, they have uh, little baby weapons, that's cool. can we build? We can make our clones a bit tougher. Pull up some walls as well. Or we can make our clones faster as well, cool. Okay, so I'm gonna get his base uh, really nicely built up and we're gonna skip uh, ahead, so we'll catch you in a bit. Okay, so um, we've massively upgraded our base now. As you can see, we've got a roof. We've got lots of more weapons. We've got this um, cool galactic axe, which makes a wham noise, which is awesome. Um, what we've also unlocked is some fire clones as well. So um, go ahead and get some fire clones going on. So I think it's going to do automatically, actually. So let's see what they um, do, if anything. I found this didn't consistently work. Or it didn't appear to change the animations in any way, anyway. I, I can't. Oh, there we go. So, there we go. We've got a fire guy going on. Oh, oh we he took one down. That 
guy doesn't stand a chance. Alright, let's go and see what we can unlock now. So I think I noticed um, we can unlock a plane shortly. Yeah, the futuristic plane, but I think we need the roof to uh, be able to park it. If I remember rightly, anyway. Let's see, let's buy it and see. So, yeah, that plane isn't anywhere. If I remember rightly, it appears upon the roof. So we'll have to wait till we've unlocked the roof. That was silly. Right, what else can we build? No balcony. This is where we can get the stairs, uh, uh, the airplane going on, I believe. No, oh, I think it lasts on the third floor. That's starting to look pretty good now. Let's check on our research. So um, as you see now we've got two of our upgrades at 100%, which now gives us 100 cash per kill. So you'll see the money goes up really, really quickly. Um, we still haven't unlocked whatever it is to do gems. I can't remember for the life of me what it is, but um, you'll naturally get to it anyway. You just unlock more and more stuff. So once again, I'm going to... Oh, I'm actually going to sell my ore. Um, I'm going to sell my ore and then I'm going to skip ahead again um, until... Uh, there's a bit of more interesting stuff going on. All right, so you can see now um, we've unlocked um, a few more bits and pieces. So we've got our gem guy over here. So we're starting to make gems now. And over here we've got our space plane, which I thought was going to go on the roof, and I was completely wrong. If I just looked here, so we go for driving our space plane. He says, "There we go." Now I won't lie, I'm not really sure uh, what we're meant to do with this at the moment. I'm guessing later on, because you can open like a spaceship as well, that's how we get to the other planets. So we'll go ahead and explore that. You can see this guy's got a missile launch on the top of his base. I think I've been shot down by these before. Let's see, what does that say on top of there? Oh, launch missile strike, okay. A bit faster. There's not a great deal to see, if I'm honest. Looking around, I thought maybe there'd be some cheeky secrets hidden. We didn't find much. Oh, down there you can see someone's pet enclosure, which we haven't built yet. Then over here is um, a little place. Let's go have a look here. Go to the space bar. See what he's got for sale. So here you can buy potions with your ore. So we, let's buy the wacky potion. See what it does. Okay, so here's the wacky potion. Ha! <laughs> and it's uh, well, it's made everything wacky. What can I say? I can't remember which one. Oh, and it's messed up with the controls as well. Oh, this is maybe a bad idea. Yeah, it keeps spinning around. I think that's my base over there. Huh. Oh god, I hope this doesn't last forever. Just a bit, uh, yeah, we made a fair bit of cash now, so um, let's unlock some more stuff. I think that's my clones fully upgraded now, apart from the special abilities. Oh, thank God that's finished. Okay, so we've um, unlocked, well, we've upgraded our guns now. So we've got faster bullets as well, so we've watched my guys down there. 
I should hopefully be laying waste quite nicely to the clones now. Someone's invaded my base there. So it should be, uh, the money should be rolling in now. Yes it is. And we've got loads of ore to sell as well. We'll see if we can unlock the giant terminal, which I think we can. We'll show you what that's all about. Remember the giants we saw before? So we shall unleash our own. Yeah, my guys are causing havoc now. What we're looking for, a giant terminal. Uh, while we're here, we'll show you what you can build with gems, because we've unlocked um, some gem mining now. That was the dude over here. We get gems, you can see these things you can buy with gems. If you're patient enough, you don't have to pay for gems, but you can buy more with Robux. Show you what they cost. It's not that expensive, to be fair. Although that, that one, what's, uh, I think it's 800 Roblox for about $10, about eight pounds. So infinite gems, nah, I'm gonna be patient, but um, quite tempting, certainly if you wanna unlock that stuff early on. And the giant terminal uh, is out here. So we'll start that charging and we'll watch for our giant to appear. Let's release the giant. Rah! Oh. Hopefully the giant will do a bit better than I did. Oh, God, we can't see him. What's he doing? He's just stomping on people. Come on, giant, do something. Wow, I'm rubbish. Oh, the giant didn't last very long, did he? One thing I do really like about um, this Clone Tycoon game as well is that it doesn't throw um, buying stuff into your face. Um, it's quite easy and quite quick. I mean, I've been we playing about maybe half an hour now, and we've built up um, you know, a reasonable base, reasonable strength, a um, few things to keep it interesting. And we've not spent any money, which is great. So yes, we can if we want to. Um, where's the, uh, did we unlock the Pagan clone already? The morph, I think we have. Um, yeah, so it doesn't, make you spend loads and loads of money which I found a lot of games on Roblox encourage you to you know they deliberately make it hard or really slow or boring um, this game at least in my opinion doesn't do it um, it's pleasantly surprising that penguin looks cool yes very happy with that so we've now got penguins with guns hopefully where are they Where's my guys? I don't see any penguins out there, do you? Hello? Alright, something's wrong here. Let's reset these, see if that makes any difference. Hey, there we go. Is he still going to have a gun? I hope so. Oh, he's got an axe. Right, we need to get the guns going on again. Okay, so we're going to check out the pet. I'm just unlocked. There he is. Click on pets to walk him. Okay. Oh, let's get a name. What should we call it? Let's call it Bloxy. All right, cool. And there's a little tiger following us around. So, Gladiator to Arena. That appeared on the other side, I think it was. OK, 
Okay, so we'll just wait for this fight to finish. Okay, so there's a new round coming. So at the moment, what well, we can we do five clones, which you can see as you progress, you can um, have different teams. So we'll put five of our clones in, see how they get on. We'll just do one fight. Oh, mine did all right then. Oh, we can hold up a sign. Whoop, whoop. Go on, go on my clones. Doing all right so far. Oh no, they're dead now. Well, that was, um, that was disappointing. Oh, oh, I've got wired one left. I thought they were all dead. Roblox Pro Player uh, is the winner. Hey, get out of it. Ha, are they stuck? Let's let them out. Right, I'm gonna leave them. I tried, you saw me try. I tried to let them out. Person is still inside. I'm trying to let this person out. Very strange. Okay, so I've just unlocked something that um, I've never unlocked before. And that's the spaceship, which isn't that that I'm stuck on. It's this thing here. And I'm wondering if that can take us to uh, another planet. So let's open the roof and see. So, where are the other planets? Can't actually see. So the telescopes were pointing at them, weren't they? Really, um, just going forwards, aren't we? We're not leaving the area, not going any higher. So, I think I must be wrong. So, oh, what's underneath? Oh, you can't go underneath. can't go any higher than that. So I'm not sure what the point of this is still yet. Let's go back to my base, maybe when we've unlocked everything else, I don't know. Okay, so we've been pretty busy. Uh, you can see up here we've um, unlocked loads of morphs, we're in this cool, don't know what it's called, robot kind of thing, which I like. And we've only got one thing left to unlock that we can buy with uh, money, which is the hacking station. So we're saving up for that now. But one thing that we have unlocked is the disaster machine. So we'll have a look at that. So this is our disaster machine. Um, and here's what we can do. So we can use gems. So we should do a giant invasion. Now, I've never seen this before. Whoa, that looks cool. Hopefully they're gonna be a bit uh, stronger than our single giant before, because that one didn't do very well. Wish I'd done the UFO one now. Well, these are doing pretty well with there being a lot of them. I wonder if I stop watching, will they go away? Oh no, they carry on. So we're going to leave them to do their thing because we should have enough to buy this last thing. And I'm hoping. Oh, I can't.
kind of hope that that would be um, would unlock something so we could beat the level. So maybe we have to do um, unlock all the things with gems as well. Let's go back over here. Let's see. Okay, so after a bit of digging around, I think I found out how we um, can complete Planet 1. So I think we need this fly tool. So sadly, I'm going to buy some gems, which I didn't really want to do. But we'll get it done. So we can get this video done. Let's buy the fly tool. Cool. Let's make sure my clones are all doing what they should be doing. And we need to look a bit better as well. Let's go as a skeleton. Cool, so now we can fly. So let's see if this takes us anywhere. That. Oh, looks like I don't know what that is. Some sort of spaceship, never seen one of those before. Oh, we seem to be moving away, which is cool. But are we getting any closer? Oh, we are moving, look, there's the lava. I'm guessing that's the lava one that's moving. Let's see if we can go lava world then. It does seem to be getting closer. So that's all we need to do. Hey, one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to save this for a uh, different video while I explore this. So uh, thanks for watching. Hope you've liked it. Um, hope you like the game uh, Clan Tycoon 2 because it's pretty good. Uh, I think just to make this video, I've been playing it for two hours. Um, to really enjoy playing it. Um, if you like what you've seen, subscribe, give us a thumbs up, all that good stuff. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much.